Thanks for coming out today, and I'll see you at my show tonight. begin our Q&A session. As most of you know, we ask you to submit questions for Kesha, and here they are. Let me begin with CNNMoney.com, Linda Chowders. How do you go about designing the styles for the Baby G watches? Can you describe the process? Well, I started with um, a design meeting with people at Casio came over, and I picked the style of watch. I wanted my watches to look vintage. And um, so then I kind of started from there, and then I designed according to my own personal style, which is leopard print and American flag themed, obviously. And, um, and then from there, I saw the final product recently and was very pleased. Um, I know Casio has felt Kesha was a natural fit to be their ambassador, but what was it about the Casio brand that attracted you to them? Was it the shared values? I like that the watches are affordable, and I like that they also can go into water, and I can take a little bit of a beating, because I'm a little rowdy sometimes, and, um, and I also just have known the Casio brand, because I write a lot of songs on Casio keyboards. From Ariel Adams at a blog to read .com, a lot of your colleagues work with some very high-end watch brands that are affordable only to a small amount of people. You, however, have decided to work with a great watchmaker that is accessible to a much larger population. Did the fact that a lot of people are already wearing and enjoying Casio and BBG watches help influence your decision to work with them? I like that BBG and Casio is affordable and also relatable. I think my music is kind of the same way. From Lily at Chat at Splendora, what do you consider your style to be, and who do you consider to be your great fashion icons? So, today, I wanted to look like a superhero um, with a really accurate sense of time. <laughs> <laughs> From Andrew Zangrilli at Thompson Reuters. Is there a common ground between designing and making music? Absolutely. I think it's a creative expression of yourself. So this is my first time being a designer, and it's really exciting. It's just another way to express my creativity. Absolutely. Thank you, Kesha. Um, in addition to watches, what other things are you interested in designing? Um, I'm right now in the process of designing a faux fur collection. It would be obviously animal friendly. And I want to design race cars. <laughs> From Alicia Kimbrell at 98.1 Kiss FM, who is the one celeb you would like to see rock one of your new watch styles for Baby G? Um, Obama <laughs> and uh, Dave Grohl. Um, 98.1 Kiss listeners also want to know. What do you carry in your purse that is a must-have on the road? Um, my purse is like a bottomless pit, <laughs> but in it is my passport and um, some Kesha condoms <laughs> and some blue lipstick and some glitter. And now I will be adding my new American flag watch. Of course. From Sheila O'Connor at the San Francisco Examiner, what has been your biggest challenge to date and how have you overcome it? Um, I think the biggest challenge is um, being the public eye. People can say whatever they want about you. And really sticking to my guns and not listening to any negativity has probably been the biggest thing I've had to overcome. Of course. From technology free freelance writer Cheryl Aj uh, Ajlani, Given that this is your first entrance into the design world, what inspired you to start with designing watches versus some other form of apparel or accessory? Um, you know, when Casio came to me, it was very, very early on in my career, and obviously with my song being called TikTok, it just seemed natural. It was written on a Casio keyboard. It just was kind of meant to be. Of course. 
from Newspaper Reforma, are you interested in performing, participating in other fashion designs? Absolutely. Totally. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm sure I'll whip something out. Of course. <laughs> Lots more to see, right? I designed this lovely piece I'm in with my onesie. <laughs> Well, thank you everyone for joining us for the unveiling of Kesha's new Casio Baby G timepieces.